Alright guys, uh, welcome back. Uh, sorry for the no audio video and last one. Um, I really don't know what happened. Uh, my device is acting kind of goofy. Um, I What I'm going to do, uh, maybe I'm not going to upload part 10. I'm just going to explain it here. Uh, so, we already know that Mr. Negative is uh, Mr. Martin Lee. Uh, he had a pretty sick ass cutscene, but I think I'm gonna skip that to uh, part nine. Uh, this is gonna be part nine now. Uh, that one is gonna be just because I escaped the room, um, fight some dudes, and I you guys already saw that on the uh, other let's plays. So I'm sorry for that, guys. Um, I really don't know what just happened after that. So. My audio even cut off and all, but I, I just don't know what happened. So I'm really sorry for that. I may I may use another footage of someone else's, um, so I can use it on that. Uh, damn, I don't know what to do. Just I'm just gonna move on. Whatever. Yes, it's what it is. Uh, device is gonna act weird. So. Hey, doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow, look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better about organizing our workspace. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. Ah, oh, man. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay. I think that should do it. You ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that, and well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Mm. 
Oh god, you shit again. God oh. damn it. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit. Reroute. Oh god, okay. So, where's the end? Ah. Uh, huh? What are we doing here? Like up, up here? Holy moly, man. Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. You sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. I missed a call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. What's that? Alright, so this video needs a little bit of editing in that hustle part that just kinda kinda drive me crazy a little bit. <laughs> So I haven't fight in a while, bro. Like in a while. Hey, sorry I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's, no expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. Guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. So let's do some side stuff. Uh, let's take some, some cracks, shall we? Alright, take the first. You want more, right? 
I really have no idea what just happened. It's been a long time since I played this. What the hell, bro? Where's my skills in this game, man? What the hell happened? I have been doing horrible. Let's see what else is here. Oh, there we go. You are not gonna believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Bet it was happy. Almost shot a rat. Martin Lee's really paying the boss? Yeah. We built this war beast for Lee. Lee finances the boss's Yo, new venture. Well, you better clean your Need to get into that office. Well. Boss sees that, he'll be pissed. You try oh, God, are you serious? What are they building? Is this all for Lee? Only samples. Boss is still perfecting the recipe, but man. Be careful. I hear something. Easy does it. What kind of great so far? Tires this big? Where is it? I swear I left it over. Anyone seen the 316 socket driver? Oh god. Hey, when are we get a new resource? That guy's not oh, going crap. anywhere. Maybe I can distract him. Gotta check it out. Hey, anyone pick up more beer? Wait! How the hell do I beat this part? <laughs> Damn, bro. Where is it? I swear I left it over here. Like, what the fuck is this? There's so many guys. Okay, so this is a tire. Has anyone seen the 316 socket driver? Like, there's no distraction or something I can use. Hey, when do we get a new recip saw? Oh god. Some kind of military hardware? Office must be to my right. I need to move careful through here. Oh my god, MJ. Oh, you're crazy Yo, shit. Man. Why's the boss being so intense about putting GPS trackers on everything? But 
detected trade secrets. Doesn't want any word on grave dust leaking out. Still, those barrels seem important. Yo, Alchemist. Man, I can't believe I beat that. What's in these? Boss, come on! Will you never notice? Stone. You're right, Rick. Uh, won't notice. Uh, Cousin won't be there. Uh, God damn it! I said I'll fix it! Uh, uh, you got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. Uh, oh. Such a disappointment. <laughs> and now I need a new welder. This is what they're building for Lee. But why does he need an armored vehicle? Here we go. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Yo, that was intense. Oh my god. Very intense. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the great dumpling catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves Devil's Breath, whatever that is. Yeah, I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, what if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a uh, spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Ah. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. <laughs> Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh, Oscorp CFO. Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? <laughs> Sorry to cook and run. Did Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh Where do you want me to uh just Couch is fine. <laughs> See you later. Yeah. Hmm. 
Oh man. So yeah guys, I'm gonna do something about the last release about Martin Lee. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe I'll uh and you guys don't care about that to be honest. Sorry. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? Let's see. Chief Financial Officer at Oscorp. Single. Known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Cause it sure feels like we are. Partners? Uh, sounds good. Okay. See ya, partner. So yeah guys, uh, I'll be doing something about the Martin Lee's uh, video. As I may upload my original one, or I may just, you know, find some footage around the internet. And um, I'm not gonna start this now. Um, so yeah guys, um, thank you guys for watching. Today is a day for somber I'll see you guys uh, maybe in the next part. And honoring fallen heroes like Jefferson Davis. But it's also a day to vow never again. It stops here. Some people say I blame everything on Spider-Man. Well, I don't blame him for the bombing. That cowardly act is squarely the responsibility of whoever committed it. But if we're gonna keep New York safe, we can no longer tolerate the kind of lawlessness Spider-Man and his ilk represent. This is our city. By God, we're gonna take it back. All right, guys, that'll be it for now, and hope you guys enjoy my videos. Um, see you guys next time, okay? Have a good one.